Honey! I need you to go to the car and get my purse. Okay, my voice is way prettier than that. Hi, it's Thursday. You're watching Thirsty Thursday. Show us Thursday and we get We drink very responsibly. <laughs> it's Thirsty Thursday on the Sticky Show. We've never done this before. It's both? It's both. Thirsty Thursday presented by the Sticky Show. Branding. Yeah. So today is the last Thursday before Halloween, which means you need to know some good ass Halloween drinks to drink. Cause you're probably gonna be if, like celebrating it this weekend. Probably alone in your place and you're like- Probably uh, not on Wednesday when Halloween actually is. Exactly. Probably this weekend. We are trying out three different Halloween drinks that seem very simple to make. So I have never made or tried any of these drinks. Which drinks are they? I'm gonna read them out one at a time. Oh, I would like to say that I haven't tried them either, but oh. I'm not quite sure. Okay, okay, okay. Sweet poison cocktail. Have you tried that? Never. The Jekyll and Hyde cocktail, which looks really epic under a black light, according oh, to the picture. I like those. I haven't had that. Me neither. And then the third drink is like a ghost looking drink that I saw on Malibu Rum's Instagram that looked pretty tight, but I'm making my own adjustments to it because I could not find all the ingredients. I've had that one. You've had that one? I have, yeah. You haven't even seen it. Well, I just, I think, I think I've had that one. You think you've had it? Yeah, I think it was good too. I thought it was all right. All right, well, you can describe the entire process of how to make it when we get it. I would love to. Okay, awesome. And then we're gonna tell you if they're tasty or not. Or if you should just, you know, buy a bottle of wine and call it a day. If you call it a Halloween. Maybe you don't even change into a costume. Maybe you just fall asleep uh, on the couch watching a movie alone. A little too close to home on that one. Let's make these drinks! The first drink we are gonna make is the Sweet Poison Cocktail. It looks like a poisonous frog. A poisonous frog is a very colorful frog? Yeah, tree, like poison tree frogs, have you ever seen? Do you oh, know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do I you know, know any about. animals? I know what you're talking about. Do you know poison butterflies? Do you know poison No, fish? butterflies all look, they're not about poisonous. Butterflies aren't poisonous? No. Try eating one. Really? Yeah. You can't eat butterflies? I'm poisoned too. Well, in a different way. That girl is poison. So for this drink, we are going to need light rum, coconut rum, blue carousel, and pineapple juice. All right, we're gonna do one ounce of light rum. That's that one right there. Okay. One Oops. ounce. Bartender. I know, I would be like, it's like I'm pouring a mixology. I want I'm to get so my Halloween bad on. bad at measuring. In, no problem. In, okay. Easy. Easy. Now, two ounces of coconut rum. Two ounces of coconut rum? Turn the party up. Because this is coconut enough rum. Oh yeah, I get it. Good, I'm glad you got that. I got that. And... Boom. Now, one ounce of blue carousel. Man, this stuff is dangerous, dude. I remember going to some improv parties and this just, was like... You just drank blue carousel? Because that's all they had left. when, you, Dude, when you showed up, even 30 minutes like after the party started, everything was depleted already because nobody like has any money. Party. Exactly. So now, so now you're with social awkward people with the blue mouth? Yeah, basically the blue tongue. Cool. But then they all have blue tongues too, because nobody else has <laughs> so any So all the late left. people have blue tongues? Yeah, and everyone else got beers. Good for them. That's why you get there early. Yeah. Good advice. Thank you. Back to our drink. We gotta get one drink in us okay, so okay. that we can yeah, stop being social, socially awkward. Let's do it. All right, we're gonna take a shaker. Yep. We're gonna put some ice in that mofo. Sweet. Now we're gonna pour this into there and shake okay. it to get it nice and cold. To not shake it? Yes. Okay. If you were on Tipsy Bartender, I'm gonna tell you to shake it and keep it sexy. Well, I always do that. That's my resting attitude, baby. You would be failing that. No, I think I'd be doing that like the whole time. Wow, okay, okay, nailed it, nailed it, nailed it. Once it's all shaken, we're gonna put it back into our glass with ice and everything. Cool. And then we're just gonna fill the rest of the glass up with pineapple juice. Oh yeah. Ooh, I'm about to sneeze. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like you're about to throw up. No, I was just like, <laughs> you <were> like <laughs> I was like, yeah, but that is the same look, isn't it? I've never seen someone go, wait, can you shake it first? I've never seen someone make that face before. Really? Make that, make that sound, oh, for, make that sound before uh, sneezing. Well, when I, yeah, when I'm about Ugh. to sneeze, because it, it's, it's, it's almost always painful for me to sneeze. Uh-huh. I don't know if it's like that for everybody, I'm sure. Nope. Yeah, sure it's, sure it's not. Great. <laughs> feel way better medically about myself. Thank you, Nikki. Always. I don't know. There might be some people out there that you're connecting to that are like, oh, me too. I thought I was alone. Yeah. Hey, let me know. Right? You're we'll not alone. Relate to me, please. Steve has very painful sneezes. I have painful right? sneezes. And what MD says is fine. Okay, I'll wait it out. Yeah. That, like that? Yeah. Why does, it, why does ours look like shit? <laughs> Why do you look like shit? Look at theirs. Oh, that looks sick. Yeah, wait. But they didn't tell us to layer. Yeah. What the hell, Delish? Why does that look so sick? Ours looks like a fucking 
It just looks like a, a green a drink. lake. It looks like a, it a looks toxic like, fucking lake. It looks like one of the, like after rain when there's like a pond. Yeah. Well, I guess it's more Halloween-y. Sure. Ooh. So far, so good. Damn, I wanted to look like that. Like most Halloween things, as long as you hear the sound, ooh, and I guess it's kind of Halloween. Yeah, can we add some of those effects? Ooh. Yeah. I feel like there are instructions. It doesn't for say. Layer. It doesn't say layer. Oops. Man, I wanted this to look way more Halloween-y. Sorry, folks. All right, well, this is the sweet poison drink. Let's taste it and see if it that's, tastes good. That's it? That's it, yeah. Yeah, it does not look like that, bro. Let me show you this picture. Yeah, look at the picture. Okay, this picture. Looks nice. What? We wanted to have like a good thing for you guys. That's sick looking. It's almost like advertising versus reality. Her profile picture versus the actual date. There you go. Your wife when you met her, your wife now, you know what I'm saying? It's like that, it's exactly like that. Back to things. All right. It's only way you learn. Let's try this and see if it's at least tasty. I mean, I would imagine it would be. I bet it's actually tasty. It just don't look like it. Yeah, it totally is tasty. It tastes like an eyelid drink. It tastes like, it tastes like pineapple juice. Is, I like it, this. Does it taste like Halloween? Not at mm. all. Not even close. Not it tastes at like all. Light. I would picture this as a summertime drink. I give it a C minus on aesthetics. C minus has got me through school. I, I, yeah, I mean that. That's a good score. <laughs> so it's a passing score. That's a good score. If you are trying to make Halloween drinks and your drink ends up looking like this, not to worry. Here's a, a life hack to make any drink be a Halloween drink. Dry ice. That's a good idea. Ow. Oh, don't okay. do that. Well, I touched it. Don't touch it. Jesus. Did you actually touch it? I know I touched the outside of the plastic oh, okay, of it. Okay. Don't, don't touch it. Don't touch it. <laughs> How do you do it? What do you do? You just well, like... you just kind of, uh, you just kind of go at it, you know? I don't what? know. What? This is the scariest part. Does anyone know? We've done this before. Yeah, I don't remember though. You did yeah. it. You just like take a chunk and... So you only need like a little tiny bit of dry ice. Oh, there's like a little hair on it. Hold on. Okay. Okay, great. No hairs in your dry ice either. Jesus. All right, here we go. Ooh, now it's a Halloween drink. Ooh, that's sick. Whoa. Dude, look at this thing. It's like... Whoa. That's actually tight. We went, oh, dang! We went from a C plus to an A minus. I agree, that's tight. This is great. This is extra credit, this dude. Is I think amazing this is amazing looking. Full blown, like, that was a Victorian success. speech, bud. Now it looks like a witch's brew. Dude, we could actually host with this shit and look like rock stars, dude. Yeah, yeah, this looks tight. That's tight. Dude. How much is a bag of dry ice? Ooh, and when you move it, look at it. Yeah, it looks awesome. Oh, yeah. How much is a bag of dry ice? It was like 10 bucks. That's tight. Yeah, let's we'll we'll try it out. Let's see, yes, yeah. Please. Probably gets you extra. Oh yeah, way way better. Just way better. <laughs> just because aesthetically, it's just much better. You know better. why? Because we're Americans and we love marketing. <laughs> just make sure you don't sip up the dry ice. Try not to, but maybe it gets a little extra yeah. fucked up, right? Heard that? Probably, but in a medical way, that would cost a lot of money on your insurance <clears throat> if you are not done paying your deductible. Got it. Message don't, don't do that. All right, cool. We saved it. We saved Halloween. I think so. Next drink. This next drink is called a Jekyll and Gin. And that is because if you are going to a party or hosting a party with a black light, it will look one color in the regular light and a different, completely different color in the, under the black light. It'll like, supposedly it glows and supposedly it looks tight. Does it? We don't know. Okay. Sometimes the pictures lie. I'm a pretty good judge of all things tight, so we're gonna find out about that. Glad to have you mm -hmm. on board. Thank you. For the, on this uh, judge, judging table. For this drink, you will need Gin, tonic water, get out of here glass, grenadine, and like some lemons, like a half ounce worth of lemon juice. Oh, and a black light, so that you can see the difference. Oh, yeah. that, that's cool too. Okay, we're gonna do three ounces of gin. Oh my God, that's a lot, okay. Yeah, so just that's go all the way, way to the top, and then we'll do another ounce on top of that. Gin has such a classy smell to it. It smells like a fucking airport lounge that's or something. True. Why is that? So interesting. It's because it's like airport lounges are old and like gin drinks are old. So. That's kind of, yeah, that's kind of the vibe. I don't know. That's my logic on it. Yeah, it has like a woody smell to it. Yeah. You know what I mean? It smells like a gentleman, like a, a lodgy, like, yeah. like a speakeasy. It smells like a speakeasy. There you go. I like it. So three ounces of gin in there. That's a lot of gin. Yeah, that's a lot. We're going to do a uh, half an ounce of lemon juice, which if you don't feel like measuring, it's probably just like one lemon. I don't. Yeah. Great. I mean, my hands are pretty big. I could probably squeeze it just the same anyway. Why don't you do that then, Steve? I'm on well, it. actually, the seeds will be. That's it straight oh, up. Oh, I see. So okay. maybe you just let the lemon squeezer do its job and you do your job, mm. which is like telling me how pretty I am all the time. 
<laughs> no, it's pretty much just running all your errands and shit. That's true. Yeah. Honey! I need you to go to the car and get my purse. Okay, my voice is way prettier than that. Then we're gonna do a splash of grenadine. Oh, I'm not getting nice? Okay. No, why? I like that you assume what I'm gonna tell you though. I was trying to open that the entire time. <laughs> I would like to point that out. A splash, just like that? Yeah, just a splash. Oh my god, you fucked up! I'm just kidding. I don't think I did. <laughs> I don't think I did. I have confidence. My goal is to shatter that. Why does he still have confidence? <laughs> then we're gonna put, put a bunch of ice in that glass. Okay. Good. Now Whoa. we're gonna put that. Maybe, maybe one too many. No, nah, no, nah, that's good. Really? Yeah, because it's gonna go down when we shake it. So put it. Now we're gonna pour whatever is in our glass into our cocktail shaker. I'm gonna shake it up a little bit. Then we're gonna pour it all back in our glass. Beautiful. Look how pretty that is. Oh, you're okay. sexy. Excuse me. So this is fine so far. Excuse is, me. Is it, oh, does it get cooler? Prettier? Oh, you think you're better than No, but does it, get, does it look cooler than this at all? Why don't you hold your fucking horses? Because it's supposed to go in the dark or some shit, right? Yeah, but we're not there yet. Okay, okay, okay. Horse before cart. Okay. Holy shit. Now we're gonna fill up the rest with tonic water. What's it with buying tonic water when I'm at Bedmo and stuff and it's always covered in dust? <laughs> Have you noticed that? It's always like completely covered in dust. Maybe you could feel buy the tonic water at the grocery store and then they don't really need it. That might be why. I don't know. Anyway, I'm working on that stand up bit. Hey, let me know what you guys think. Pretty good. And this is a Jekyll and Gin. Jekyll and Gin. Let's taste it first. We'll taste, take, taste the Jekyll part first. Okay. Ooh, that's pretty good. I like it because it's not too sweet. Oh yeah, It, it tastes great. like a grapefruit. It looks like, I don't know if it's because the color looks like a grapefruit and then it's kind of throwing me off. It does taste like a grapefruit. It does create, I don't it like grapefruit. It tastes like a grapefruit. Okay. It, 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 it tastes good in the initial thing, but the after bite has the same grapefruit thing. I like grapefruit. If you like grapefruit, you probably like this. If you don't like grapefruit, you probably add a little bit more simple syrup, or you could add gren more grenadine. I don't know why I don't like grapefruit, because it's like, I like sour shit, but it's just too tart. It's bitter. Yeah, it's yeah, too it's bitter. Yeah, it's a little bitter. That's the gin there. The juniper berry of the gin. What's a juniper berry? That's a berry that's it's a juniper berry. Like, what's, what's a blueberry? It's a blueberry. I don't no, know I know what a, everyone knows a what a blueberry is. I don't know what a juniper berry it, is. It grows on the juniper bush and it's a fucking berry. What is that real? Know? Yeah. It's it called is. a juniper bush? Yeah. Okay, you ready to see the badass Jekyll part? Yeah. Or the Hyde part? Yeah, let's do it. Gin Hyde part? Yeah. Whoa! That's tight. That's so cool. Oh, that's really cool. So just stand, just make this drink and stand directly under a black light. And, and drink it under a black light as well. <laughs> <laughs> and just kind of hang out under the black light. Wait, 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 but we're not done yet. We gotta make it extra Halloween. And this is already pretty Halloween because of the butt. Yeah, of yeah, but yeah, now we it's might as well go for it. it up a friggin' notch. Might as well go for it. This is the Sticky Show. Thursday, Thursday presented by the Sticky Show. Ready for something. this? Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Shit. Whoa. That's tight. That Can they so tell how tight cool. it is? I don't know. Can they tell how tight it is? I mean, it's really tight, guys. I it's don't know what to tell tight. you. This is way beyond my expectations it ever could have been. This is like when you're watching a Nickelodeon movie when you're a kid and like some kids doing science. Dude, I was always jealous of the, those volcano experiment things. Oh, me too. We never did anything like that. Nah. It was like the cliche of all those movies. Like, yeah, oh, yeah. you just go to a dumb volcano. I'm like... You know why? I bet you because when those writers were writing that shit, they had to do that in like the 70s. Yeah. Also, I can't tell if it's because um, it's right next to the light. Yeah, me either. Like, I can't tell if it's actually working or not. Yeah. But it's sick. But it looks sick. The light looks sick. Maybe just get a black light. Just get a black light and don't even and worry about it. And just carry it around with you. Does it taste better now? Yeah, of course it does because it looks better. Yeah, it looks cooler. You won't mind that it's grapefruit flavor now. Okay. I like it. <laughs> I like it. I'll drink it's this one. Just not for me. Not I'll for drink me. this one. Not for me. I give this. A B plus. I would give this honestly a C flat. A C flat? Yeah, C. It's like a musical note. Yeah. Oh, okay. You're rating it in music? I was in chorus. When I, I was rated it five Ichabod cranes. Out of how many Ichabod cranes? I don't know. Out of the Ichabod crane scale, I would give this three and a half Ichabods. Out of how many? Out of ten. Oh. Whoa. That's a low score. It's less than a C flat. You gave it a 30% score just now. I don't know math. What grade did you get in math again? I didn't I didn't get good ones, <laughs> I'll tell you that. A C flat? If I was lucky. Our last and final drink is something that I found off of Malibu Rum's Instagram. I've never tried this before. 
Um, I don't know what it's called either, so I'm just gonna call it a Malibu because oh. that seems fitting. You love it. He loves it. It's great. He loves it. It's really good. Oh my god, he loves really, our really marriage. Like you ready to make this drink? Yeah. You need one, probably. I do. To make this drink, you will need Malibu rum or another coconut rum. Cream of coconut. This is like the fancier stuff. I think this is like the good shit. But you can also get like a can of, of coconut cream from uh, a regular like coconut milk section. Apple juice and some whipped cream. In their recipe on their Instagram, they did a cotton candy, white cotton candy. I didn't have access to any white cotton candy at this time. Where, where would you get that? I don't know. What is white cotton candy? Well, if you have a cotton candy maker, you just don't dye it anything. Oh. So it's just white cotton That's candy. That's cool, man. You know? They might great. have it at Target. I don't know. Well, whatever happens with this, I'm sure it'll Not be sponsored. just as good. Yeah. That alone sounds like this whole drink. Look, I'm sorry I couldn't get white cotton candy. No, it's fine. I'm, I hope that this drink is still satisfying for you for, the, the, for your Halloween festivities. But think about the how white cotton candy I don't candy want to think like about it web. because I can't have it. But it looks like spider I know. Web. It sounds really tight. I don't have it. I don't know where it is. Got it online. I know, I know, I should have gotten it online. Well, but you could get it online probably. I'll put an Amazon link, it's probably an affiliate link. I'll probably get some money from that. So oh, that's tight. That link. Do you get a lot from those? I don't know, not really. You get like 10 cents. I don't know. Do you really? I don't know. <laughs> Why I, do it? I honestly don't know because people tell you to do it's it. Like, it's like Taylor Swift getting Spotify. No, people are She's like, like, I got 10 cents. You should put Amazon links in your description. I don't know. They're down there. I don't know. I honestly don't know what I get from that. Gotcha. I honestly put it in there more for people watching than I do for That's awesome. Me I love because it. I, because I say go get it and then they're like, we're where? And right. I'm like, okay, well here and probably I'll get 10 cents from it if you click. So, hey, win-win. Hey, better, better than nothing. I'll do the research for 10 cents. Yes. We are gonna start with one part Malibu. Let's go for an ounce and a half. Ounce and a half. Yeah, and then we're gonna do one part coconut cream. Yeah, this is like mayo, bud. This is like a really interesting yeah. container. It's legit, shake it. Shake it? Shake it really well. And it comes out like mayo? Like, is it like no. a spread? No, but thank you for being uncultured swine. Yeah, I don't, I've never had this. What, what are you doing with this? So we're gonna- Squeeze it? Yes. So. <laughs> it's so mind boggled, but I don't, it's crazy. Yeah. I'm at, I think- It's in a squeeze bottle, so you squeeze it. All right, this you is, smart ass. Jesus, I'm just asking a question. Okay, so wait, uh, how, how many, how many? I think you might need to take this, uh, the seal off, because it's a brand new bottle. Oh yeah. yeah. Did you test it because well, you, you I thought like I was it, lying? Sure, because you never know. Well, some have seals, some don't. You know that. Yeah, I saw the seal, so aware. I said maybe you should take the seal. Well, off. I thought that it's because it's a light liquid, it would be white. Well, maybe anyway. you shouldn't think, and you should just agree with your wife and be more agreeable well, as a person. Try not to do that. Oh yeah. Damn. <laughs> All right, now what do I do? All right. So now you're gonna put an ounce and a half in there. Ounce and a half. That's an ounce Yay. and a half. Yay! I mean, look at this <laughs> shit, dude. That's weird looking. Yeah, that looks good. This is actually scary so far. This is a fucking Halloween really? drink so far. Yeah. Okay, so I'm adding some coconut milk just for color purposes. If you get coconut cream in the can like this, uh, but instead of coconut milk, it's coconut cream, then you it, you don't have to get coconut milk too. I'm just adding it for color. Sure. Yeah. So we want it to look white because it's supposed to look like a ghost. Okay, got it. Now we're gonna do two parts apple juice. So we did one and a half ounces for the one part, so we're gonna do three ounces for the apple juice. Wow, that's gonna be all the way to the top. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Now we're gonna shake it a lot. We're gonna shake it for <laughs> we're gonna shake it for like 15 seconds uh, over ice just to make it really, really, really chilled because this isn't gonna be ice in the glass. Okay, work. It's not gonna be ice in there. That's work. Over ice then? Yeah. So make sure this is like filled with ice. Ooh, you close. did good. I was, was very close. worried about that. I was too. Now shake that up really good. Okay. Okay, now before you pour that back in, because we want it to look like a ghost, take that coconut cream, or you can take simple syrup, something that can make a, a chocolate chip stick to a glass. And then we're just gonna put what? one dot there. I see him sliding. Shh, the ghost, he's like the liquid or whatever he's he is. He's sliding. He's air. Look, this wasn't part of the recipe. This is just a Nicky Limo. Is it? Being extra, yeah. I see. Because I want my bitch to look like a ghost, okay? okay? They're all about to slide right out. Shh, don't be a hater. I'm not trying to be. Look at that. Does that look like a ghost? Does it? Hell yeah. Wow. Yes! Okay, we're not done yet though. To make it look like even more like a freaking Halloween drink, <laughs> we're gonna add some whipped cream to the top. This is the part that you could get white cotton candy for if you have it, but I don't have access to that. 
sort of fancy. No. That's sh fancy Take shit. Take it easy. Maybe get new whipped cream, you know, so that like yeah, it's not like old whipped cream that oh, you don't know. Oh, this is the old one? Yeah. Either way, just add dry ice to this. <laughs> That's what you're gonna do. Oh my god, not even dry ice on this dry too? Ice. You were proud of your goat. Yes. Just be proud of your goat. Oh, well, I want to be. That would be very proud. Oh, uh, you should have just been proud of it. I'm an Asian mother. This is going. You're going a little hard on this one. Hey, man, be a better ghost. Ooh, we're having a good time. <laughs> it's bubbling over. Look at that. That's sick as fuck. It is sick as fuck. <laughs> that looks really That's Halloween. That's hella tight. Let's talk about a scientist. You look no further than That's right here. That's pretty tight. NikkiLimo.com. Sure. Actually, it's, it's Nikki.Limo. Yeah, great. Yeah, I know my website. Look at that. It's dope. It's a ghost that's getting his brains completely blown out. Like yeah. he, he, like maybe he died that way. Ghosts I don't, don't know. have brains. Get detailed. Ghosts don't have no, brains. No, when he was a human, maybe that's how he became a ghost. I see. Maybe he like went too far down deep in the sea and got the bends. You know what I'm talking about? Are and, the bends? Yeah, bends. If you come, if you come up too fast, you you get like bubbles underneath your skin. And oh, then, and then right. You just implode. I think. Gotcha. Oh, it's very scientific, and I know lots about it. It smells good. Does it? Yeah. All right, let's try it. Damn. Is that good? That is excellent. That's the best reaction I've ever seen out of Steve. Mmm. Wow. That is motherfucking wow. bomb, dude. Woo. You know what? That is really good. That is a really That's good That's so drink. good. Dude, if it takes her 45 minutes, who cares? Dude, you should just make this. You could make a big batch of this and scoop it in and then just put whipped cream oh, on it. Oh, that's a good side. idea. You make know, a big batch. You know, they probably know how to host a party. This is real, you ever can do. That's good. Wow. And then redo it for Christmas. I'm shocked. <laughs> it could be a, like a white snow bake Christmas thing. This is so good. Nate, try this. Nate's yeah. helping us. With Nate's helping us out. Steve's brother, Nate Green, everybody. Everybody knows Nate. I would give it a 10 out of 10. 12 out of 10 Ichabod grains. This is 10 Ichabods. A plus 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 plus. Absolutely incredible. The drink of the season. Yeah. Like, if you were having a Halloween celebration. This is the best drink you've ever made. Really? By far. Wow. Mm -hmm. The praises. All right, well, thank you for watching Thirsty Thursday, sponsored by The Sticky Show today. I hope you Appreciate enjoy you. these Halloween beverages. At make your, the third one. How, just skip to the third festivities. one. festivities. Honestly, do. Yeah, if just, you're gonna make one drink, definitely make the third one. Done. Cause who's gonna who's gonna spend a hundred bucks and make all three drinks? You know no. what I mean? You gotta pick one. No, right? that's why it was just ideas for no, you exactly. to make. But that's what I'm saying. But in our best judgment, we would just recommend you do the third one. Absolutely. But if you ever if you try to make any Halloween drink and it's not working out for you, just have dry ice. And here's the thing, it'll save you, your whole party. It's not too sweet either. It's like it's really good without being too sweet where you're like, oh, yeah. this is like I'm drinking sugar. Yeah, yeah. very refreshing. Yeah. Also buy a black light, like. <clears throat> Yeah, they're fun. Turn up your volume. Just don't put it in the bathroom. Pump the jams. All right, well, thank you for watching uh, Thursday Thursday and the Sticky Show. We are doing the Sticky Show every Thursday. We also have a podcast. Oh, wait, can I plug a thing? Are you going to plug the podcast? I was going to plug the podcast, yeah. Go ahead. Hey, guys, we got a podcast. We want to make sure you want to check it out. Can you enunciate when you plug it? You got to make sure they want to check it out. We do it every single Thursday, and you can... You can subscribe to our podcast on CastBox and you on can, Apple and on Apple and on uh, Android. You can listen and, to it for free, right? And, or you can just go to my channel if you want to watch the whole thing. You can actually—it's a company oh, yeah. video on my channel. You can watch us talking while we're podcasting, and it's pretty fun. Oh, and can I plug another thing? No. Bye.